Yo, what is up guys? It is Sweeper. We're back with another banging video. Today we're gonna be running some top ladder right now. Um, using a Royal Giant deck actually because I don't know man Goblin Giant just has not been doing it for me this season And I want to try some new things out because hey Cyril's around the corner competitions You know that fun stuff the fun stuff we want to get into so we got a two minute queue time right now So I'm gonna cut to the first game. All right, so first game where is Ian here Also running the cannon here an absolute goat one of my great friends Ian 77 So we're gonna go goblins there and go cannon here. I don't know what deck he's running. It could really be anything so what I kind of want to do is I want to go Little Prince in the back here. And just kind of see. Because this could be a lot of things, right? So, we, yeah, we got Mother Witch. And we're going to go RG at the bridge here with the Mother Witch. Because we are going to pop the Little Prince ability. And, yeah, this should be okay for us. Like, look at that. It's beautiful. Everything worked out the way it's supposed to, eh, boys? Then we're gonna go. Go we're gonna go. Giant skills on top of this. Nah, oh, it's a crazy play, by the way. We're actually gonna rage all of it because we can. It's gonna die. Uh, the problem here is so he's running this loon deck, right? This loon deck's kind of popped out of nowhere. I don't know why it's so popular recently. Um, I guess because it beats minor decks, just because how loon is, and it kind of beats cannoneer decks. I don't know. I tried it. Did not have success with it, so we are trying this deck out right now. Uh, if he goes Loon here, I'm probably going to go Goblins and go Little Prince. So we're going to go. There we go. Little Prince. Okay, then we go RG at the bridge because that's just way too much elixir spent. He literally spent 10 elixir on offense there, so there's no way you're going to be able to defend this like completely properly, right? I have arrows as well because he wants to go Evil Bats, which we are just going to arrows. And yeah. Good for us. Uh, we're gonna let that go. Problem now is though, like with Little Prince, is basically they can outcycle your your uh, your push. So we're most likely gonna lose our left tower here, which is really shitty for us. So I'm just gonna go Giant Skeleton in the back and see what we could do. Um, Cause yeah, if he goes in at the bridge, we're gonna have some problems. What I could do is I go Goblins in the back here and go in with this, cause like I'm not pushing this right. That's two hits. Oh, that's only one hit on tower, actually. Oh, no. It's Jover for us. My bad, boys. I, I really fucked up here. I did not really expect all this to happen. Like this. GG. My bad. I was hoping for something different. He's going to try to defend, which I don't think is the right play to do. Because... I really do think we can just break through here. Yeah, defending this was not the play for him. We have a good defense, though. With, like, everything. Okay. It's good for us. Um, it's not really bad for us, though. Okay, wait. Maybe we can actually do something here. Maybe not. Okay. Wait, that's actually perfect for us. I'm gonna rage us all. You go bomber here and Yeah, we're so good. We are actually so good at this game. Everyone else in this game is a noob. I swear we're the best player in this game. So here we go, beating Ian for the first game, and now we're gonna cut to the second game. Sorry for ta talking much there, when interactions become that close. And now we're versus Molite, so we got another noob that we are versus. We're gonna start with the good luck and give him a little bit of a, uh, little bit of a, mm, is, is he gonna make Kissy back? I don't think he is. Sad thing is I probably could have actually just, you know, ignored that. So I'm going to pop ability here. Because I can. And see where this goes. So I think he's running. Um, okay, that's interesting. 
It's not a tower either though. If he decides to go ability here, I'm just gonna go goblins on top of this. Cause yeah, that should destroy it. Unless he rages. Really good log by him, but actually great log by him. To be honest, arrows was an overcommitment. Didn't need that. Probably should have gone Mother Witch first to tank for it. Cause I like I said, I have a lot of licks right now. And the biggest mistake with like I notice players do is they have a lot of elixir and they just don't use it right so I lost the game already I can already kind of admit this and what I basically is gonna happen is he's gonna go mortar on defense and defend all game it's really it's really annoying but like it's the right play to do you know I respect it uh, I have to go in here though because like I said certain cards should not be in cycle so this should get like one hit doesn't even get one hit though, which is I think is nuts. We know Goblin's at the bridge though. If he responds with Knight, I go Bomber. Yeah, so I'm gonna go Bomber at the bridge here. This should get two hits. I think they nerfed Bomber range, did they? Or am I tripping? I might be tripping. I don't think that Mortar was good though. I think that Mortar was really bad. I can't go up selling though because he does have Little Prince. So he'd fully defend that. Let's see what he's doing here. So that's not something I can do. I can go Little Prince in the back right though. And try to defend this. I'm going to pop ability here though. And go kind of with all this. Loki want to rage this. And that should make it the tower because we raged it. Oh, we're so good. No, we're actually him. I, I gotta get those arrows down though. That's on tower? Oh, we're the noob. Ignore me. Jesus. We're the noob. Good game. Oh, I think if I actually just go to opposite lane there because the little prince, I win. I actually win. Oh! Super close game versus a noob of Clash Royale. Now we're gonna hop into another game and we are versus this Mega Knight player, who should be a free win. Um We got Mother Witch, we got a lot of things. And Lower Prince too. I actually think we're chilling this matchup. So let's see what we got here. Um I'm just gonna go with Jaskill in the back. Crazy first play by the way. But it should work. Um maybe I should have just ignored those. Sometimes I don't know what to do here. Like, what is the actual right play? He might go Mega Knight the bridge. Kind of what I was thinking he'd do, but he didn't. Pop ability here. Kill everything. I forgot Bomber was already back in cycle. I could kite this with my own Bomber. So, like, all is good, you know? Uh, I think he has arrows. So, I don't want to... Oh, he does not have arrows. I'm going to Goblins here. If he goes Bats, I Rage him. And that should be a good amount of damage. Tries to pull it back. Really messes up. So yeah, that was a horrible minor by him. This rage really catches people off guard because of the interactions, right? With like giant skeleton going a bit faster, it just kind of turns that cognitive thing in their brain and makes it really um, makes them mess up essentially. <coughs> Alright, so we're just gonna roll giant at the bridge. Why? Because I can. Alright. See what we got here. Pop off. I'm going to kite this with a bomber again. Let's go. Alright, then we're just going to rage here in the uh, right lane. I don't know what his plan was there. Like, this guy's really not a good player. <laughs> in the nicest way possible, this guy's not a great player. But, anyways. Um. <laughs> I feel so bad saying that, but it's it's true. Probably gonna go goblin gang at their bridge. I don't know, let's go giant. Yeah, like, congrats. I don't know. Like, what's your, what's your goal here? That's on tower. Yo, what is this guy doing? Bro. Bro, bro. Why 
bro, bro. What are you doing, bro, bro? Oh no. It's over for bro, bro. Yo, bomber, shoot. Word. Let's go, brother. There you go. GG. Another game down. What, 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 what? What, 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 what? That was confusing, though. He just kept spamming. He literally let eight giants kill me go to his tower. I'm like, dude, what are you doing? Like, I was, like, waiting. I'm like, okay, he's going to defend eventually, right? So we're at number 36 right now. Let's try to get to 3.1K. Uh, we got another minute queue time. Let's see if we could get a game in. Five, four, three, two, one. I'll cut to the next game. All right. In the last game, we are versus Warboy here. And, uh, yeah, so he's running normal tower. I'm going to go bomber in the back here. Let me just go RG at the bridge. Reason being, it's okay to be a little aggressive. Like literally, that's what I noticed about this game is it's all about aggressiveness, man. Like, my tower's going to kill that, so it's okay to be aggressive here. And on a defense, this is going to be a pretty easy defense as well. So I think it's just a minor cycle deck. This should get a hit or two. It still gets a hit. Really good for us. All right, I could pop ability here. And go goblins as well. And yeah. I'm not even worried about this. Like... Yeah, like, see, that defense is really easy. This game's all about aggressiveness. I, I've noticed that more often is it's okay to be aggressive because the cards are now just so broken in this game that they win the game for you. So we, we get a tower shot, and you can defend with, like, one elixir, two elixir, and little prince. So it's okay to play, like, an absolute uh, troglodyte. Is that the right word? I think so. We're going to go evil bomber at the bridge. I don't think he has arrows. So let's see what happens here. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Alright. If that is not telling me to go in right now, I don't know what is. But see, like, how easy it is to defend when you have, like, broken cards, right? It does not matter any amount of skill that you have in this game. You got a little prince, right? So you defend any amount of push and elixir. So. GG, well played. We're going to obviously defend this with all the cards we got. We got arrows for his troop. The fact he lightninged a bomber and got away with it is still absolutely nuts to me. But we will accept that. And we're just going to rage this right now. Get run and go here. Pop ability. There you go. Okay, bomber decides to just not go for what I wanted it to. But, you know, I respect it. You do you, bomber man. We're going to go goblins behind this. Because uh, he doesn't... Oh, he died. Wait, wait. <laughs> I thought he'd arrows, but I arrowed. Okay, I'm kind of dumb. Ignore me. If he goes in, I go in. I'm just saying that right now. Because, uh, yeah, that's how this game works. And we're going to defend like this. Look how much damage we take. Like, see how broken this game is? <laughs> like, just so broken. Man, this is Clash Royale in 2024, boys. This is Clash Royale in 2024. This is nuts. He goes in, I go in. I defend cheaply. Let's get it. One. Two. Yo, it's too easy. You know what I've been missing, guys? I have not been going aggressive enough. You need to be more aggressive, boys. Please play more offense, trust me. If you have Little Prince or any like building in your deck, you can defend so cheaply because this game is dumb fundamentally. And yeah, guys, like this video, subscribe if you're not subscribed. I'll see you guys in the banger video. Peace.